Because neighbors keep eating them. And he wants to remind everyone that is against the law. But it's okay to give Jules some treats. No, and you know what? I bet your parents don't go back to that house. Yeah. Little Jules is not messing Good around. Good dog. <laughs> well, it is opening night at the Reign of Terror Haunted House in Thousand Oaks. It's only four weeks away. Wow. It's considered one of the scariest in the country. It's at the Jazz Marketplace at Hillcrest Drive and Moore Park Road. CBS 2's Brittany Hopper takes us inside the spooky opening night. It will leave you screaming, <laughs> jumping, and then screaming again. <laughs> the Reign of Terror in Thousand Oaks opened tonight and has been ranked as one of the top ten walkthrough haunted houses in the U.S. As you make your way through the 80-room, 15,000-square-foot haunted house, you never know what will pop out at you. <laughs> The creator, Bruce Stanton, started this haunted house 16 years ago in his home. It got so popular over the years, he turned it into a professional haunted house. The experience that I loved as a kid is why I'm, I'm involved in doing a haunted house. It has six different themes and 30 actors volunteering their time. The haunted house comes with many surprises, scaring everyone at any age. And I'm like, what's going to happen next? So like, who's going to pop out next? I'm always prepared. It was awesome. <laughs> this haunted house will be going on every weekend until Halloween. And proceeds go to the Teen Center of Thousand Oaks. In Thousand Oaks, Brittany Hopper, CBS 2 News. <laughs>